Hi, this is Shelley Belcourt and I'm going to take you through the steps to teach you how to advertise using mobile on the InMobi website platform. Okay, so here I am on um, InMobi, I-N-M-O-B-I dot com and you just click on the sign up and it will just ask you to fill in your registration, your email, password, name, phone number, etc. Um, just up here, click advertise your um, if you're not quite sure you can go up here monetizing is if you've got an app that you want to advertise on or the advertise is to generate leads or promote your business which is uh, if you wanted to get leads then you do the advertise select the advertise so once you've done that then you will sign in and you will get a username and password and they will ask you to um, verify your account um, once you're through. So just um, follow the steps that you receive on the email. And when you have an account set up, you'll be uh, shown the login page. And so you can just log in here. And so it'll take you straight to the dashboard. Now, you click on the campaigns button. And then you click on this button here, which the green button that says New Campaign. So you give your campaign a name. And you can select the start date, which it's automatically selected for today. And that, that's just pre-selected to run three months. Now I've just popped $10 in this account. You, you can um, put however much you want in your account. And so you would give a budget for this campaign, which clearly I can't do more than $10 here. And the daily budget, I would put 10, 10 bucks as well. So then you save and create ad group. Oops, I've already done test, so let's just put test one. Okay, so depending on what you want to advertise, you can promote your app, generate leads, promote some content, or generate awareness. Now that is, if you're wanting to, um, you know, anything that you want to drive people to, essentially. But most of the time, you're going to want to generate leads. Now, you can select a URL, SMS, or call on the call to action. If you put a URL, um, that's the best best way I like to do it and then you grab your landing page which is mobile optimized and you put it in here so you would have to have one pre-selected I'll just grab one from over here so I'll just put in one of my campaign URLs and then you give it a name the ad group name so you can you can do under that first title you can do individual and you can do several different uh, campaigns within the group the one group so you could um, I'll just call this test one again depending on how you wanted to arrange your campaigns and click continue so now here you have the option to target um, by by where the the region so you can select um, whatever countries you wanted to. Let's just say I wanted to select Australia for this particular campaign. And then you also have the um, option to select by um, latitude, longitude, zip code, or um, this is custom region, which I haven't actually used, that one. I'll go back up to two regions Australia is selected there and you can if you customize you can uh, select particular states within the country that you've selected I'll just leave it as as all of them so you can target individual whether you wanted to have it on Android's on your desktop all these options I just usually go all devices so you've got a you've got a broader range now the, this advanced targeting, I wouldn't recommend you start on this to begin with. Um, if you, I mean the the options are there. There's um, 
more demographics. So if you wanted to have male, female, you can select specific ages. Um, this one here is whichever type of browsers they're using. Um, again, I just leave all selected here. And you can have your target displayed, your ad displayed on um, a web or in an application if, if someone's looking in the application on their mobile phone to have your ad pop up. And if you sometimes, um, if you've done some testing on your ads, you know that uh, at specific times, then ads get a better response and that's what this scheduling is for. So when you've sorted that out, you can click continue. And here is when you put your bid price in. Now, depending on um, where you've targeted, your price will be pre-selected. So here it's 0.05. Sometimes it's as low as 0.01 or 0.03 of a cent. Or cents, should I say. So this is five cents. And your daily spend limit. Um, I've already selected the budget, so I'll just let's, let's say I'll put 10 bucks on here. And click Save. And your ad, ad creatives, you can add a picture, a pre-selected picture, if you wanted. And here you write, so if you, if you upload your image, um, let's just see what I've got on here. Let's put a photo of Fiji up there. Actually, it has to be um, tiny. I think that's going to be too big. Uh, it's got to be 38 times 38 pixels, so it's really tiny. And so here you can either, either select a banner or a text ad, um, depending on what you want to do. Now, I this is where you write your text. So, um, you know, uh, whatever you wanted to write. Find out more about beautiful Fiji. And then your ad text, free holiday packages. Let's just say that. Okay, save and continue. Uh, if you've got, you can select tracking here, but you'd have to put a, um, a pixel code on here, which I don't have just now. Click save and essentially that's done. So now you see the status here. So here's your creative name. Find out more about beautiful Fiji. Status is pending approval. The InMobi team will go through and just check that everything's above board on your ad. And within usually a couple of hours, you'll get your ad approved and you will start seeing impressions up here and clicks. And it also gives you a click through rate. So that's that will get you started. Now, if you are wanting to have um, an opportunity to have free landing pages, mobile landing pages, which are dead simple, I can help you out with that. Just click on the link below and that will get you through to me and I'm happy to help you out. But otherwise, I hope that's been helpful for you. Have a wonderful day. My name is Shelley Belcourt.